What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. What we're doing is something we've been looking to actively do. Today we are test driving a 2019 Duramax, a Z71 Silverado 2500 HD. So far, we've taken it off the lot, we've given a run around, and this is different. Let's start with the interior. Compared to one of the other vehicles we've driven, which was the Ford F-250 Super Duty, it's kind of small. It feels very tight, similar to my 2007 Suburban, and that's not terrible, but it's also not something that I've looked forward to. Me being a large size guy, not too massive, but large enough to be a great intimidation factor. Size has been important to me. So the roominess of it is not optimal, but it's okay. Turbo diesel, Duramax, motor allison trans and um from what i can tell you so far it feels good strong motor full smooth we don't have any weight on it right now but this does have a nice tow package with airbags in the back and a fifth wheel hitch so it comes pretty fully loaded it's the ltz full package heated cool seats it is very optimal for any and everything that you may consider doing so what we'll do now we'll get down on it here in a second talk about how she feels on a little bit of power. Whoa, whoa, sheesh. Okay, it's got turbo diesel power. That is for damn sure. That was a pretty nice pull. We'll stop back here and we'll take a look around and we'll talk about them and uh, we'll show you guys what we got. Stand by. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a 2019 Chevy Silverado LTZ 2500 HD from front to back. Z71 off-road package, fully loaded with toolbox. Won't talk about what they want for it, but we will talk about what we have. We have a great vehicle, 2019 model, still have quite a few bells and whistles on the inside, but on first feel and drive, it's impressive. It has the power that we're looking for. It has everything that we know we'll need when towing a vehicle, but we'll talk about also some of the cons, interior size. It doesn't feel as comfortable as the F-250 that we drove. Me, for my needs, comfortableness is very important. Great side steps on here. They're not retractable, which is okay. Also comes with airbags, as you can see here. Ball hitch in the back for fifth wheel if we ever get one. So if we wanna go and get something bigger, we've got the ability to go ahead and tow anything that we put our mind to or put our pocketbook to and get it done. Uh, this is the four door. Duramax motor, Allison transmission combo that I always want to drive. And I will tell you, she's smooth. She's very smooth, uh, big bumper grill in front, the, the Chevy way as they most definitely like to do. Um, it's impressive. I won't say anything more than that. Is it a Ford? No. Which one, in my opinion, is better for me? I guess we'll have to stay tuned to find out the details, guys. Interior wise, as you can see, beautiful interior leather all the way through center console charging heated and cooled seats of course it's the lt of course this is the ltz trim package it has all the bells and whistles on the inside it's roomy i will not lie it is very roomy but is it as roomy as the f-250 again i will have to say negative here in the back nice size seats still looking like you can put a couple extra features back here but hey who knows Gives us room to dream and have great ideas. It's been a quick walk around, quick piece of content for today. This is us doing our market research on vehicles before we commit to purchasing one. This again is a 2019 Chevrolet Silverado 2500 HD Duramax Allison Trans Combo. And hey, we're just gonna end it right there, guys. Come back, see more diesel test drives as we get ready to make a decision on what we wanna pick up for our arsenal. Thank you guys for tuning in. See you next time.